Hey, what's up there everybody? Jamie Wagner here again. Hey, thanks a lot for watching my video here. What I got for you here is the Nexus 4, the Google Nexus 4 phone, and I am going to update to KitKat 4.4. So the OTA version here is available. Real quick, I just want to go in here and show you that I'm currently running Android 4.3 under this build, JWR66Y, so Android 4.3, and we're gonna give this bad boy an update here. So let's go ahead and start the update here. There it is, Android 4.4 system update. Let's see what happens and uh, see with the uh, download and verified right here, 238.9 megabytes. All right, so this update's going to upgrade the Nexus 4 to Android 4.4 KitKat. So let's go ahead and st start this restart and install. It says they're rebooting to install in one second. So rebooting now, and it's automatically powering off. This is the first time that I've had it on my phone, you guys, and <clears throat> I just thought I'd do a quick video here show you what the uh, OTA version looks like, what takes place, see how the process goes here. I installed this recently on my Google Nexus 7 2013 second generation tablet. Um, it went smoothly and it is running smoother. So I haven't really gotten into the operating system to pick it apart but I will be doing more videos on uh, KitKat 4.4. So there's our little guy Andy installing the system update. Pretty much the same as my Nexus 7 video. Shouldn't be much different here. There's little things spinning there. Wait and see what this looks like once we get it installed. I was going to go do this manually, but I'm like, you know, I'll just wait for it to come down and be available to uh, upgrade over the air. So I'm excited to get it on there and then see what's going on with it. Go through all the changes. I, I guess there's a lot of changes with it. I think there's a lot of new pixels in uh, Android 4.4 too, as well as a lot of UI elements and new design patterns. So we'll see what, what that looks like. Not in this video, but I'm going to check all that out. Maybe do another video later. Still waiting here. It looks like it is just a little over halfway done. So it just goes to give you an idea. It's been about almost four, well, three minutes and 45 seconds so far here. Just gives you an idea of what you're looking at <clears throat> as far as download time and install. Looks like we're over three quarters of the way done. I want to take a look at the new dessert case too. Once I get this thing up and gone, we'll go right in there and take a look at that. So we're just about finished up here with the uh, update slash upgrade. And it's almost been about five minutes now. Again, at least you know what to expect if you go ahead and do this. If 
finally here we're getting a restart. So that's pretty cool. I saw that um, same old stuff here on the Nexus 7. If you watch my previous video, some of you have, I'm sure. And another restart. Well, another installing system update. I don't think that happened with the Nexus 7. So it'll be interesting here to see what's what's going to happen with this. So I'm just going to keep playing here and we'll just let this go all the way through. I actually want to let it go all the way through. That way if you guys try this, then you know what's normal, what's not normal. So there he cut out. It didn't look like the bar went all the way through, but it's restarting again. So this is getting pretty interesting here. I'm not... Probably just a couple restarts. I wasn't sure if that was normal or not, but I believe that's pretty normal. And I think we're probably going to start now. At least get to the lock screen. Android <clears throat> is upgrading, optimizing app 2 of 121. So yep, everything's gone smooth. A couple reboots there as you saw, like I'm um, doing the upgrade, which is more than likely very normal. So there you can see it goes through and uh, optimizing or optimizes all your apps. About the same as it was on the Nexus 7. Same speed. It's been about 7 minutes and 45 seconds already here. <clears throat> Still moving along pretty good, so... I'm thinking we're going to have this done before nine minutes. So 88 looks like, 's funny like it spends a lot of time on some of them, but then it goes faster on other ones and jumps right through the number to the next number. <clears throat> oh, almost done here. Starting apps, upgrading media, finishing boot. Hey, there it is. Hey. This arrow here, there's no more circle. I can't even believe it. Let me plug in my password. All right. And there we are, booting to the home screen for the first time. So thanks a lot, guys, for watching my video. And... I hope you guys enjoyed the video and it gives you an idea of what you're looking at to do the update. Thanks a lot. Have a good one.